up? This is Jules, your travel buddy, and I'm gonna tell you about what I personally like to bring with me on my hand carry. First and foremost, the most important thing, your passport and your itinerary, because you never know when they're gonna ask you for these, and they always do. Pen or a pencil, just to sign all those pesky forms, and a wallet to keep your cash and your cards on you. Now, when you're on board, you tend to get Board. And so it's best to have forms of entertainment. You have your iPad, your Kindle. I personally love to read, so I always bring a book on with me. And if I'm good enough, I'll finish the book, and that's great. Headphones, dual purpose. You have that for your movies or your music or just noise cancellation for the baby crying in the back, the woman snoring next to you, the guy laughing out loud. Done. You're set. At some point, they are going to die on you, just like your smartphone. Low bat, no problem. Portable charger, always gotta have your power bank, or an actual charger for whenever you can find a socket. Now, let's both agree that airplane food is just the worst, and it takes forever to get to you. It's always best to have something to nibble on. 2016, we're very healthy, fit bars or fruits. And after eating or after having a long flight, you're gonna land, and you're gonna wanna smell fresh. And that's the reason why I like to bring with me my handy dandy toothbrush and my toothpaste, an eye patch for sleeping, the key to the better when you land. Sunglasses, just in case it's bright and sunny. And for the girls out there, a sanitary napkin, because just like me, I never know when I'm gonna get my period. And an extra tip, they take away your water bottles for some reason, and that always kind of pisses me off, so I bring with me a water jug. Keeps me hydrated at all times. And that's what I like to bring with me on my own hand carry.